today is going to be a good day because I am hanging with Hugh Coles. You may know him as George McFly, starring on Broadway in Back to the Future. Yep. How you doing? I'm doing very well. Where are you taking me today? Well, where we're going, we don't need roads. Yeah. Back in time, we're going vintage shopping in Brooklyn. Come on. Let's go. We are in the heart of Brooklyn, just outside Williamsburg, at Raggedy Threads, which yeah, is... You love vintage shopping. I love it. That's it... all I do when I'm not in the theatre. I'm just in Brooklyn going from vintage shop to vintage shop. Yeah, and you know what's so cool? So, you are not new to this role. I know you were doing this across the pond. Mm -hmm. But you really have made a home for yourself here in New York. Yeah. And I feel like vintage has something to do with 100%. it. 100%. Well, specifically in Brooklyn. Yeah. Like, Manhattan's great, but Brooklyn, like, I knew... Because I've been on holidays in New York a couple of times, and, you know, I'd always come out of Manhattan and go to Brooklyn. And it was always a dream of mine to live in Brooklyn because of the vintage, because of like the community aspect of everything, and the coffee and the craft beer. Because I'm a loser, and so I really enjoy. Or amazing. Or amazing. Or amazing. I mean, let's just talk about this musical too. Mm -hmm. I mean, George McFly. See, this is a movie that I grew up with. <laughs> Do you have a line that helps you get into George? Yeah, yeah. I'm just not ready to ask Lorraine out to the dance, and not you or anyone else on this planet is going to make me change my mind. <laughs> well, it's very fitting that we are going back in time, right. vintage shopping. Yeah. Tell me about this store in particular. What do you love about Raggedy Thread? I love America. Um, <laughs> I love American sports. And I love, it's something about the, um, the, the visual culture of America, which is you know, lots of brands, mm -hmm. lots of sports logos, lots of university um, sweatshirts. And I love that style, like the old Americana kind of thing. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, I've got Michigan here. I was going to say, is and this all I've, vintage? It is all vintage. Then I've got the Chevy t-shirt <laughs> underneath it. But Raggedy Threads and lots of other vintage shops in the city do it so well. And you can only find this specific kind of vintage in America. Wait, you gotta see the back. Look at that. I feel like I am giving your George Marty McFly vibes. What yes, you yes, what it you is. Think? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're Marty, I'll do George. We'll do the washing line scene. Done. Great. Done. <laughs> Done. Next up, where have you brought me? We're going L Train Vintage, and this is a lot less curated than Raggedy Threads, and this is for everybody. So if you're brand new to vintage shopping, come to L Train Vintage, grab a coffee, bring your friends, and like just rifle through it, because that's how I started. Mm -hmm. And then if you really catch the bug, you'll end up at Raggedy Threads, you know, like looking through the really like 1940s, 1950s stuff. This is all sort of 1990s to 2010s, and everything in between. It's giving um, prize-winning trouts. It's giving um, bowling with the girls, <laughs> the retirement girls. Love it. Thank you so much. This was a Thank pleasure. Thank you for coming with me. It's great to have company.